We are going to be opening a box that's already opened by viewer Jeff. Yes, viewer Jeff took the time and sent me a box and clearly wrote on the top corner, viewer, I must not have seen it, and I opened up the box. So I already know what was inside. I'm so sorry, Jeff. I, I dropped the ball. But at least you guys don't know what's inside. And I got to admit, I am pretty excited to reveal what Jeff sent my way. If you guys would like to send anything my way, whether it be drawings, letters, anything you'd like to see me review on this channel, I'll put all the information down below to my viewer address. And let me just stress this as well. When you are sending something, make sure you write viewer. Even though this reviewer didn't see that and old Butterfingers opened up the box already. But I have to admit, going through it and opening it up a second go around, I'm perfectly fine to do that because the neat stuff that Jeff put inside. He put also on the label cereal box. Hmm, I wonder what that means. I didn't know what that meant either until I opened up the box and found that Jeff took the time and sent me all the cereal boxes for Halloween. Something that has eluded me for at least the last couple of years. I think the, the last time I looked at these, I had to order them online because my stores here in Canada just didn't stock them. So here we have the General Mills Back for Halloween Count Chocula made with monster marshmallows to go along with that. He also sent me Frankenberry with artificial strawberry flavored marshmallows. And he also sent me Boo Berry. And we'll just put the box right over there because we don't need the box anymore. He sent me all three cereal boxes. A big thank you, Jeff, because I, as again, I didn't, I wasn't able to find these at my local stores. I did actually check. I looked around to, uh, I want to say about five different grocery stores just in the off chance that I might be able to find these. And I found nothing. Apparently he found them though and was nice enough to send these my way. Um, I wanted to delve and open these up right away and scarf into the cereal, like just mow down into the cereal. But I thought, no, 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 no. I'm going to wait because Jeff took the time and sent these my way, I'm gonna do these for an actual spooky spot. Which I can't even remember the last time I actually did a review of these, but I'm, I'm really looking forward to these. From memory serves me, and it is, it is fleeting at times, memory serves me correctly, I think my favorite cereal of the three was Frankenberry, but as a kid, I always remember really liking Boo Berry, and I don't know if it was maybe that Boo Berry was so elusive, it was harder to find. Of the three different cereals, I could never find Boo Berry, and I might have had it once or twice as a kid. It's artificially flavored, in this case it's artificially berry flavored frosted cereal made with mar monster marshmallows. I wonder if they've changed up their recipe at all. On the back, there's all their different characters as well, and it's neat that they've dressed them up in different designs. So like Count Chocula down here is dressed up as Frankenberry. We've even got like the Trix Rabbit. We've got Lucky from Lucky Charms. Even the Pillsbury Doughboy is taking part in the Monster Bash. Um, it says this party's haunted. Can you find all 10 hidden ghosts? Well, we won't. I guess I sort of gave some of that away, but I'm going to wait and do a full video of these for the month of, of Spottober. Wow! Again, thank you, Jeff, for taking the time and sending these my way. I had absolutely no idea that he was going to send these my way. And silly me, silly, silly me, I opened up the box thinking it was something else. And I'm like, what is this? And I opened it up, and I should have seen that on the side of the box it said viewer. I'll know better next time. Like I said, if you guys are interested in sending me any uh, letters, if you'd like to draw something, if you'd like to see me review something... I'll put the information down below to the viewer address. Just make sure, even though this time it didn't work because I apparently had my eyes closed when I opened up the box, make sure you write on it, viewer, viewer, so that I know to open it on camera. Many more videos will be coming your way. So as always, thanks for watching, guys. And I'll see you next time.